What a great salvation is ours. That you would take away all our condemnation and lay it upon your Son. That he would die once and for all for the sins of his people. That he would expiate our sin, that he would carry it outside the gates of the city so that it would be ours no more. That you have taken our sins and removed them as far from us as the east is from the west. That, Father, we stand before you clothed in the righteousness of Jesus Christ. We are not boasting in our own righteousness, but we are boasting in what you have done for us. And we accept it. And we rejoice in it. And we stand in it. And Lord, we thank you for the work of regeneration whereby you changed us. You took out our heart that hated you and replaced it with a heart that loves you. You took out our heart that loved sin and hated righteousness and you replaced it with a new heart recreated in your image in true righteousness and true holiness. And we thank you, Lord, that we no longer belong to the kingdom of darkness, but we have been translated into the kingdom of your dear Son. And we so appreciate, dear God, that we no longer are slaves to sin, but can offer the members of our bodies as slaves to righteousness, and that we have victory even over sin, even over the devil, even over this fallen world, not by our own hand, but by the power and the glory and the honor and the greatness of Jesus Christ. And we stand in this inheritance that you have given us. And Lord, we will not allow anyone to rob us of this great gift or take away our joy. Be glorified, Lord, in your people. And let your people know that they are loved, they are forgiven, they are changed and they are being changed from glory to glory and that one day they will stand before you without spot and without blemish. And oh God, the one who has the smallest repentance, the one who has the smallest faith, let them come and drink of that fountain freely. Oh God, there may be people here this morning who are saying, but is this for me? Is this for me? Oh dear friend, do you want it? Do you desire it? Then come. Are you thirsty? Come. Are you hungry? Come and drink freely. Eat without cost. Oh God, that salvation may visit many, many households. In Jesus' name, amen.